Okay, I'll see you later. Yeah, okay. You take care now. I'll see you later. Give me a call. Hey. It's not what it looks like. Okay? It's not like that. We talk. So do us all a favor and keep quiet. Sure. But Phil, and I don't mean to take advantage, but maybe I need help on time. Maybe I can give you a call. What do you mean? <sighs> I mean... I need to find something out about someone. Maybe you can help. Are you fucking blackmailing me? No! I'm asking for a favor. Why do you think I put my neck on the line for you? Because I need help with something. You know, since you don't look like you're full of crap, how could I say no? Enough of this chit-chat. Come on, let's go. We're heading back up to that old house off Beaverhead Avenue in West Dyke. Okay, I had word from Frankie, my nephew, that no one's been paying undue attention to the age we took off the triads. We're gonna go pick it up. I thought that was a wedding present for your nephew. He's my nephew to my ex-wife. I might give him work sometimes, but I ain't gonna give him this load of horse. He wants anything except a bit of muscle work? He can ask the bitch to take it out of the divorce center. Fuck it, You had, uh, any more girlfriends since the ex-wife? If you're getting smart about seeing Angie at my place, then you can butt me. The two of us is just friends. We talk. We both gotta take a lot of shit from Jimmy, and it helps to speak about it. I wasn't making no accusations. Yeah? Well, that's something that Ray likes to run his mouth about. Ray runs his mouth so much that no one pays much attention to what comes out of it. <laughs> I'd believe it. I'd be dead already if Jimmy P listened to anything he said about me. If only the feds knew how full of shit most wise guys were, then maybe you wouldn't have such problems with people turning states. The feds know that wise guys run their mouths. They love it. The feds don't care if he's taking someone down on a legitimate beat or if it's total bullshit. As long as he can get his face in a newspaper and a blowjob from his wife, he's happy. Fuck it, feds. There you are. Frankie, you've been keeping your eyes open out here. You seen anyone snooping around? I ain't seen a soul, boss. It's a ghost house. I got the horse loaded into two cars for you. I don't know, this don't feel right. Shit, Frankie, you dumb fuck! The feds have been watching us all along! Nico, get in that car and follow me! We can't let those feds run the boss off the road! Get them! I've been looking after her. And my sister? I've been putting her through college. 
Shut up! These feds are all over me. I'm sorry, man. It's just, I only got married the other day. God, I love that kid. You want to see a picture? I don't want to see a fucking picture. I'm trying to get us out of this situation. Maybe then you can spend time with your wife instead of some jailhouse bitch. Crap! We're losing them! We're screwed! Deal with the feds, Nico! Follow me. I got a van we could use. More fucking bacon shit!
I don't think I can take much more of this. Nico, you've done good for me. There's been some fucked up shit going on, but you've been keeping cool. You're a good earner. I got respect for you. Hey, let's see if we get back before you start talking like this, shall we? This ain't over until we got the H in the safe place. You're damn right. Nice driving, Nico. We're gonna be able to shift this H for a lot of money. Might just keep the Begarino family's head above water. See you around. Hurry up! I'm busted for a slash here! Eh? 